be very brief. I want to talk very briefly about the auto strike. I'd like to say a few words about the contract negotiations between the United Auto Workers and the big three auto companies. You know, I've been in touch with both parties over since this began over the last few weeks and over the last the past decade. Auto companies have uh, seen record profits, including the last few years, because of the extraordinary skill and sacrifices of UAW workers. But those record profits have not been shared fairly, in my view, with those workers. Last night, after negotiations broke down, the UAW announced a targeted strike at a few big three auto plants. L let's be clear. No one wants a strike. Say it again. No one wants a strike. But I respect workers' right to use their options under the collective bargaining system. And I understand the workers' frustration. Workers deserve a fair share of the benefits they help create for an enterprise. I do appreciate that the parties have been working around the clock. I, and when I first called them at the very first day of the negotiations, I said, please stay at the table as long as you can to try to we'll work this out. And the, they've been around the clock, and the companies have made some significant offers. But I believe they should go further to ensure record corporate profits mean record contracts for the UAW. Let me say that again. Record corporate profits, which they have, should be shared by record contracts for the UAW. And just as we're building an economy of the future, we need labor agreements for the future. It's my hope that the parties can return to the negotiation table to forge a win-win agreement. To continue our active engagement, I'm, dis I'm dispatching two members of my team to Detroit, Acting Labor Secretary Julie Hsu and White House Senior Advisor Gene Sperling, both of them have been involved up to now, to offer their full support for the parties in reaching a contract. The bottom line is that auto workers help create America's middle class. They deserve a contract that sustains them in the middle class. The negotiation. Should Hunter get a pardon? 